Hey guys, what's up? This is a uh, NHSD06. Welcome back to part nine of Let's Pay. Let's play, not Let's Pay. This is free. Let's play Link's Awakening DX. All right. So uh, last time we had a little fiasco with the uh, key cavern, key cave. But I think I got that all figured out, hopefully. And uh, this is the very first uh, edition of the recording from the new ROM. So, hopefully, not going to have as many problems, but we'll see. Alright, so we just finished the key cave, and we need to go and find out what's up with this animal village. We have to go s south from uh, the Canalay Castle in order to get here. You just got to head south for a bit, and then you head right, and then you'll be on your way. It's important that we go here. If you read the sign from a few parts ago, it said the prairie was to the right, and then farther right was the village, so we'll see. Aha, sigh. On such a nice day, we need a song from Aaron. Alright, they're talking about, uh, you know, the ginger from the village, so we'll see. You're in a desert? There's a way to get there to the south, but you might not be able to get through if that lazy walrus is in the way. What is this guy talking about? Walrus? Well, it's Animal Village, shouldn't... Oh, stupid rabbit. If there's an Animal Village, shouldn't he be in the village? Yeah, I am sure Don Vich. The man has touched you by the bay is my masterpiece. To tell you the truth, the work is not complete. The art, it's difficult for you to grasp, is it not? I guess so. Go away! That's the douchiest typo I've ever met in my life. What a jerk. Epo, Epo, Pedotibus. Hey, did you know Animal Village and Maid Village are sister cities? Yes, even though they aren't large enough to be called cities. Anyway, I heard from a very good source that they have a dream shrine in Maid, and that has something good inside. Is that true? Well, that's just wonderful that you heard that because uh, we already went there. And this music sounds familiar, Mr. Wright's house. You don't know the proper etiquette when dealing with a lady, do you? You should have brought flowers or something. Then I might be more inclined to talk with you. Oh, yes. In my case, hibiscus are best. What a jerk. Talk to a lady? Whatever. What have you done for me? Whatever happened to all men? Women were created equal, huh? I can't go to Meat Village because of all the monsters. I hope Marin is alright. <laughs> Wuss. You can do whatever you want. Oh, there's a bear. <laughs> Some pots. Hi ho, hey you, is that possibly a whatever that's called? A honeycomb you have? We I just ran out. Will you swap it for a pineapple? Heck yes. You exchange the honeycomb for the pineapple. It might not be a sweet, but it sure is delicious. Hi ho, yeah I know that tub of goo is asleep right in the way to yarn a desert. Once he's asleep he won't budge for a long time. But hey, take little Marin and wake him up with her song. That slob would wake up with a jump if he heard her sing for sure. Hey, ooh, reverse bestiality gross. But anyway, I thought it was kinda of funny, uh that uh pineapple that he has, it's it's like sitting next to him. Once he gives it to you it looks completely different. It's like not even the same pineapple anymore. Alright, so we're gonna find out what uh What's down this way? Oh, there he is. There's that stupid walrus. Yeah, he's dreaming about Marion. That's kind of creepy. We'll just go ahead and assume that he's dreaming about her song, but hey, 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 you know. Kinky little walrus there, huh? Alright, anyway, so now that we see this warp tile, the warp tile that we had originally in the Ukuku Prairie is pretty useless, but now that we found this one, it is not so useless, and it actually serves a purpose. So jump on in there and warp yourself back to the beginning of the prairie so we don't have to backtrack. It's kind of convenient. They decided to put something in here to be nice to the gamer, I guess. So we're going to head back into the village, and we got to go get that... Silly girl, suck this boy. Where's she at? Marin, she likes to stare at the ocean all by herself. Why? Hey, I'm just a kid. Don't ask me. That is a good freaking answer. <laughs> Why should I tell you? I'm just a child. I know nothing. All right. I bet he's 13. <laughs> if anybody catches that joke, then uh, you know me too well. But anyway, all right. So she's down by the uh, the ocean. So we're gonna head down to the 
Taranbo, I believe that's what they're called, the Taranbo Shores, some to that effect. We're going to head down there and uh, check her out. I say the word uh way too much. I apologize for that. She here? No, they're just crabs and those little swirly things. All right. Well, she's down here then. Oh, there she is. Oh, Pat, I'm glad you found this place. Will you stay and talk to me for a while? <laughs> like it's like, no. All right, the only thing about this little cut scene, I guess you could call it, that I enjoyed was actually the music. I thought it was kind of a cool little remix of the of the Windfish song. And it's just basically her and uh, her talking about how she's w curious about the island and how all this crap is happening. She's like, oh my gosh, I love you, but I can't really say it out directly because that would be silly. And so she's just talking to him. Link's just kind of sitting there. He's like, uh, what? And then later on she'll ask him. She'll be like, are you listening? And you have the option to say no, but do not say no because it'll make you go through this entire spiel again. But uh, anyway, while this is going on, and I don't feel like reading through all this because it's stupid. Uh, while this is going on, let's give some uh, let's give some shout-outs. I haven't really had the uh, opportunity to do that yet because all my videos it's been hard enough trying to get them to work. So let's do some uh, let's do some fun shout-outs here. All right, so uh, for all the uh, for all you viewers, I really appreciate all your uh, time spent watching these videos. You know, you don't really have to do this, but you do it because you. Because you're good people, so... Anyway, let's go through and list some of my loyal viewers, and... If they're doing a Let's Play, I'll let you know what that is. Alright, so first on the list, alphabetically, is... KZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZZ
Sean, my friend Brian, Simp 1989, and Commie Punk 13, I believe that's their name. So, yeah. Uh, they don't have any videos, but they're just my friends and they've been watching my stuff. So, just gotta say thanks for that. Alright, anybody, uh, I'm NHSDL6. Thanks for watching part 9. Uh, subscribe if you like. Peace. Thank you. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye.